This technique enables clarification of the pathophysiology of cardiac diseases through investigation of the correlation between in vitro and in vivo parameters in animal models and humans. The main advantage of this technique is that it allows the study of cardiac myofilament function using very small biopsies or samples that were stored frozen. This technique allows assessing in vitro the impact of therapeutic interventions on myofilaments. Before attempting an experiment, it is advisable to practice the cardamyocyte extraction a few times to learn how to select, glue and activate cardamyocytes with a good size, striation and shape. Before beginning the procedure, adjust the temperature of the testing apparatus in-chamber to 15 degrees Celsius and turn on the force transducer and the motor. Thaw 3 to 5 micrograms of myocardial sample in a petri dish containing 2.5 milliliters of relax iso solution and use a scalpel to precisely cut the tissue into small pieces without causing unnecessary cell damage. When all of the tissue has been cut, use a cut pipette tip to transfer the entire volume of solution and tissue fragments into a Potter Elvehem glass, and use a grinder to mechanically disrupt the tissue at 30 to 40 rotations per minute. When a good cell suspension has been obtained, add 250 microliters of Triton to a 15 milliliter tube containing 2.25 milliliters of Relax ISO, and add.